How's it going guys? My name is Graham and this is a first look at the brand new game Wood and Stones. It is the first game from Studio Malacca. They described it as a survival resource management game where you have to cooperate with the NPCs. You're a bunch of cavemen, there's dinosaurs. If you just try and free solo this one, you're you're done for. You're never going to last. So you got to band together with the NPCs and, and try and stick it out. Thank you to the developers and the people over at Indie Boost for hooking me up with uh, an early look at this one. But it is actually out now, as of the time I'm getting this video out, so you can go check it out for yourselves. I'll have a link to that in the description. I've been told it's easy to get familiar with, very difficult to master. <laughs> so we are immediately getting chased away by the biggest dinosaur, and everyone is totally ditching. There's a, there's a lot of resources. The worlds you start in are procedurally generated, so things will be a, a little bit different each time. I'm just trying to load up on whatever I can, really. I, I guess I'm not even confident in what I will be needing, so it probably just makes sense to just grab a bit of everything. You guys can collect some apples. I appreciate it. I appreciate the, the help that you appear to be giving. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully you guys stick around. If we band together, you guys carry my apples for me. As long as all of us work together like that, then we'll, we'll be totally fine. You just try not to slip and slide away too far away from me. I, I expect I'll be needing you in the future. Just stay, stay handy and as soon as I get hungry, then you can load me up. Luckily that didn't uh, feel like it, just, it didn't want to swoop in on us and decide to kill us or anything. I thought maybe we could camp out for the night in there. It doesn't really seem to matter. Oh, maybe I, maybe I don't I don't think I collect all the little mushrooms and things on the ground. I thought that would be important. Be a better way of sustaining myself. Maybe we try and have a, a diet that has a little bit more to it than just apples. Oh, oh my resources are totally just like piling up on the screen there, but they, they have like physics to them. So when the when the wood dumps on the top right area there, it literally drops in and it takes a little bit to like settle out. Oh, maybe killing the little baby Triceratops is a bad idea. Because now I'm a little bit concerned that the big Triceratops is going to come after us because of that. Maybe maybe punching above my weight class there a little bit. I should probably try and wait till I feel like our society's a little bit more established and everything first. Is this thing heal? It is healing me. It's very peculiar. Weird magic shenanigans going on there. I'm also just being told to just keep going right, so I, I guess that's what I'll just keep doing. Ah, great! Alpha Cavemen will help in the journey. What? He's got like a very modern looking facial hair. It looked like trimmed and looked after, you know? For whatever reason, I'm not used to seeing cavemen with like groomed hair for some reason, because it's not a thing. Clean the highlighted area and make room for a campfire. Do you guys want to help out, or are you just here to just collect? Just pick up any resources that I drop. Because I, I, I would like if we could all work together on this little project here. Currently, it seems like by cooperation, they meant you do absolutely everything. And these guys will just watch. And they'll they'll just reap the benefits. The one guy is dying, hungry, injured, something. He's missing a heart. Alright, guys, get to work building this. Uh, do it. Do it. <laughs> I'm just, I'm, I'm gonna go kill more things. That's something that I seem to know how to do. I've, I've yet to figure out how to request a specific building. Oh, do we not have enough rocks? Is that why he's wigging out? We don't, we need more resources to build it? That's fine. Here's another animal that we can kill. Could you build the campfire out of dead animals? There, there seems like there could be at least a little bit of a trade-off. Ooh, I can run. Oh, I'm gonna get you for sure now. Come back here. I need to bash you good. Ooh. Okay, that thing's messing me up. I couldn't land any attacks on it. Oh! You, you're you okay eating the fruits on the ground then? My guy wasn't willing to do it. He seems to just ignore all that sort of stuff. Maybe when I'm injured? Oh, that's the difference maker is that I had to actually be injured to access it. Hope no one cared about these rocks. I'm not sure why we're not, like, making use of one of these caves. Oh, ride the boulder, ride the boulder, that seems so fun. Oh no, oh no, 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 okay, bail, bail, bail. Uh, Alpha Caveman, or whatever he's called, defend us. Nope, okay, they're, they're kicking boulders at us. I'm gonna send that back at them. Nice. 
The first Alpha Caveman is dead. Tutorial can't continue. What? He seems unimportant. It, oh, for some reason it raised like a Donald Trump caveman. Come on. What the shit am I supposed to do? All right, defend us. He didn't die, did he? He fled at the very least. Oh, okay, the X's in the eyes doesn't mean dead. It just means he's he needs a break. He needs a breather. Maybe if I just keep clubbing. Wow, okay. Apparently size isn't everything. <laughs> <laughs> if I just keep eating these little treats on the ground, you guys keep chewing up my little my little homeboys here. Get out of there! I need this fire. This is important for me. All on my own. I don't need anyone. The game is incorrect when it says that it needs cooperation. I don't believe that for a second. This seems like exactly the sort of thing that I should be able to manage entirely solo. And you can't tell me otherwise. Oh, maybe it requires more- Get out of here with my- That's my rock, dude. I don't want you bringing my rock at me. Yeah, nice, it does actually do damage to him. Alright, I'll just keep both of you at bay. Damn it. Oh, okay, terrible timing. I was thinking I could just permanently time that well. <laughs> Food doesn't even seem to be an issue or anything. Oh, he got one good bite in. The world needs another leader. He did, he did his best. He tried. We gotta give him some credit, you know? I'm guessing that the campfire is a two-man job and that I shouldn't have been in, been trying to do it on my own like that. Oh, is this guy dead? <laughs> he didn't survive fleeing that initial, like, cutscene attack? I know it showed one guy, like, fall on his face, but that's ruthless. This very much looks and plays like a Flash game in a way that I think might not be particularly charming. Loads of caves. I don't know if bad, like if dinos spring out of those or anything. It seems like it's not a, a major concern in any way, shape, or form. Not really major or minor. The caveman's ability to chop down a tree using nothing but a, a blunt club is pretty impressive. Their mastery of tools. Oh, this thing just dropped poop at me. Or on me. Okay, it's a bad thing. Uh, apparently you don't want to roll around in pterodactyl shit. I wouldn't completely rule out other poops yet. We, we just know at the very least that that one's no good. Other other dinosaurs, we, we need to further test. Are you going to get over and help me with that? Thank you. Okay, do I have to get in there too? Yeah, okay, two. Alright, minimum two. Well done. Finally got a, a legit fire roaring. And apparently I'm, okay, apparently I just am making fires forever now. Take your time to help the tribe, but there's more you need to know. I think it's a, a very efficient strategy, you know? If I just, oh, okay, he's done. He's done that animation loop. I was thinking if he just never stopped uh, pr practicing making fire, he just gets so good at it. It's a good, uh, efficient form of multitasking. While you're going around looking for resources to collect, just keep practicing. That twick twirl in motion. Do you need lumber? I could hook you up with a bit of lumber. You as well? I don't know what you guys want it for, or what good it does for me to give you things you ask for, but I'm just trying to keep everyone happy here. The more of you there are around, the more likely it is that you get eaten by the dinosaurs before I do. Build a campfire close to the lair to neutralize it. Uh, okay, I guess I gotta figure out what the, what or where the lair is. I, these guys, everyone's steaming, except for me. I don't really know what that is. I don't know how I become steamy, if I want to be steamy, if I don't want them to be steamy. I gave them the wood they were asking for. Uh, I thought they would be thrilled. They aren't covered in poop the way I am? Did that thing just drop? What the hell's going on? I think the pterodactyl dropped a rock on me, and then my caveman buddy chucked a flaming log. That's awesome, guys. Do more of that. How do I... I, I want to pick one up. I want to chuck flaming sticks. <laughs> Your guys' range of throwing is just god-awful. Ah! Littlefoot! <laughs> it looks way too much. Way, way too much like Littlefoot. Come on, he dumped right on my brains. Get out of here with that noise. Oh, should I, do I have to build it? Alright, there's more. There's more. Oh, that was good work, guys. Okay, having the campfire is solid. This guy doesn't stand a chance. Barely need to do any bashing at all. Taking taking the battle straight to his house. If I just keep thunking him, uh, 
little triceratops baby. You're not gonna be able to help anything. Uh, finally, someone else is covered in shit now, too. Now I don't have to feel like it's just me. Because if I was the only one who stank, then I would feel like I would I would need to worry about it a little bit more. Everyone would probably not want to want to be around me or anything. But now that there's a few others who are feeling the same way, who are in that same boat, I, I don't feel quite so bad about it. There we go. Help me help me build this fire up. Oh, maybe we can't in the rain. I think they all just extinguished their torches. I wasn't expecting rain. Crazy stuff. You're not the same one, are you? It is. Either that or I'm a lot stronger than I thought I was. Uh, I don't know where any everyone went. All of my allies pieced out pretty hard. Oh yeah, chuck stones. That's good. I'm okay with that if we don't have flaming sticks. Regular stones. Dry stones. Possibly a little wet is is the next best thing. I, I approve of this. Okay, okay. I, I also approve of you sacrificing yourself for the greater good of the entire cave colony. It's... it's what I wanted and what I want is what goes that's how we run this society you guys here well he got pooped on the second he was born come on guys okay I'm very injured okay I was carrying an apple so I was able to bail myself out with that I better understand how that could be used for healing I only have one more apple left oh no 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 I'm out of apples I probably shouldn't try and fight this one out anymore. I'd give you an apple if I could, dude, but you're uh, a jerk. Kind of a kind of a greedy asshole. Don't really don't really feel like helping. You'll you'll all be fine. Oh, you guys want wood? I can hook you up, and then you guys can make sweet sweet sticks, flaming sticks to throw at things. All right, I gave you guys a ton already. You guys, you can chill out. Use the ones I gave you first before you come asking for more. Oh, the smoke is because they're carrying torches. I finally get it. Wow, those flaming sticks really mess things up. Uh, I don't want to get any closer than where I currently am. I, I feel like I'm kind of surrounded by enemies. Uh, I need your guys' help. Take take the logs. Take them, take them, take them, take them. I need to, I need to eat. Let me at this eggplant. Trying to clear out this area so I can so I get the hut. I want it to be mine. I'm trying to claim ownership here. You a little palm tree, you're ruining this. Okay, maybe that's not what it takes to like claim ownership of it. I thought I thought I was doing it. Thought I was doing a thing there. Oh, well, he went and got himself killed. I feel like I don't really want to get any closer than that. I don't understand how I'm occasionally just like claiming some of these like huts. These caves. The caves that are filled with men. See, that that one, it, there's like a bunch of trees around it and everything. I didn't like carve out the space to, to lay claim to it. Wow, okay, just walk straight into the flaming sticks. That's a, it's a very good deterrent, actually. Seems like that one ran in to deal with its dead little baby that was on the ground. But then, uh, sucks to be it. It just stood in, in fire. I'm unlocking achievements all over the place because these things are just killing themselves on these flaming sticks. I'm gonna cut down all the trees. You guys make all the the hot sticks, and it's a uh, it's a perfect strategy. Ah, that one's learned. He's using rocks. That was a that was a hell of a swing there, Trump Jr. The Donny, I call him. Oh yeah, that's a lot of hot sticks. Dead dinos just piling themselves up. They just couldn't resist. <laughs> what perfectly adapted, resilient genetically fit species they are the, oh god damn it <laughs> he reached across the fire and just chomped me right in my torso i kind of deserved it the way i was taunting him honestly fine i take it back you're genetically fit i didn't mean it genetically fit and covered in hot sticks the the physics of the way they get sent like sailing back up the hills is just preposterous ah okay these he's they, they're learning to defend themselves a little bit better here. Come on, man. You got wrecked. You look like a little bitch. It's just like a... Okay, good. Good work. All of you showing up at the same time there. That's, that's very useful for me. I should probably stake out campfires more often as, like, home bases. I don't know if that's entirely how it works, but that seems to be what I'm trying to do. This is very good, easy to hold these guys at bay. The dinos, I think, are smarter than the cavemen, though. They realize that they can just attack during rain, and then there's not a whole lot I can do about it. 
except for throw rocks. Invincible, always powerful rocks. You guys weren't ready for that. Next level big brain thinking, huh? Move aside, Neanderthals. The next species is coming along. The unbeatable rock throwers. Using the real improved cerebral capabilities there to be able to truly lay waste to these dinos. They won't know what hit them. But I'll know, and the answer is rocks. If their brains were even just the tiniest bit smaller, I'm sure they would figure it out for themselves, but... Dummies! Big dummies! Look at that one! Just threw himself dead at my feet! Didn't even stand a chance. <laughs> okay, the amount of dinosaurs that you actually have to fight is insane. They're kind of non-stop. I feel like, uh, maybe it's because it's nighttime or something? I, I guess I don't know a lot about dinosaurs. I didn't realize, like, every dino that ever existed was, uh, nocturnal. <laughs> They're all just running around doing their nighttime shit. Oh, I'm gonna su I'm super gonna die. Take take rocks. Take them, take them, take them. Yeah, good work, boys. Boys, cave boys. <laughs> You're doing a bang up job. I I'm out of energy or something, so I couldn't actually run. Damn it, I was very much unable to flee. I, I think I managed to, when your health gets low or something, then maybe you're not actually allowed to flee properly. How many damn achievements does this game have? It gave me one every like 10 seconds. I have half the achievements in this game. Mm, closer to a third. Closer to a third. But still, what? <laughs> Why is there so many achievements? I kind of want to go take a, a peek at that now in the menu. It's like, makes me think I don't know what I'm working towards other than just infinite amassing of fruits and rocks. I think the game froze. Not a great sign for wooden stones. Achievos! 20 wood, 50 wood, 150 wood! Oh, okay, these are ones I haven't got, so I've, I've been lacking in the stones, haven't cut down enough trees, destroying rocks, killing enemies all over the place. I don't know what the, the little plants are killing the plants, I guess. Yeah, it's, it says killing enemies, so I thought they would both count together. Collecting fruits, eating vegetables, find the pet. That's a thing that I did? I think I killed it, if I did find it. Find an alpha caveman, that was pretty easy. Build a certain number of campfires. Probably get covered in poop. Maybe it's eat poop. A lot of these are have to do with eating, so there's a real possibility that that's where, what that achievement is linked to. <laughs> I feel like I got one more attempt left in me. Could probably do better than that. That was a, a pretty weak showing overall. The game really emphasizes the co-op, but I seem to do quite well the more on my own I am. He says as he gets his head literally shit on. Nah, that's not totally true, is it? You can barely attack on your own. Like, I feel like I would prefer to be one-manning it, but the game is set up in a way that does really force like, a need for the AI characters. I, I should, shouldn't should devalue them so much. They're trying their hardest, even if they are moron cavemen. I shouldn't assume too much about their personality. That was the point of that whole, like, series of commercials back in the day that were all about, like, oh, it's easy enough for a caveman. And then it would show the cavemen, like, filing their taxes and, like, playing tennis together and everything. It was great, great marketing. Uh, I've acquired a lot of apples. I'm gonna be very, very healthy. I'm gonna be the most nutritious caveman there is, right up until I get eaten by a dinosaur. I wonder if the game is set to not trigger dinosaur attacks, like full-on ones, until I, I complete, like, the initial base. That's a theory I'm kind of testing, so I'm going, like, really hard on the resource harvesting for the time being. Hoping that it won't actually throw any dinosaurs at me until I reach the initial camp. Okay there, uh, you gotta stand somewhere else or else I I'm just gonna bash you in the head the whole time I'm trying to collect these rocks. Wonder if calling a caveman Ugg is like offensive. Just using like a generic assumed name. I bet they- I bet they're not down for that. They have personalities, individual identities. They don't need to be distilled down to just what they are. A man of the cave. You back off, pterodactyl. I don't need your biz right now. I'm busy, busy clearing out this stuff. I don't even know what it is for. I just figure if I clear out everything around it, then maybe it'll be a thing. I can't, I can't like invest in it. 
That might be like a healing spot or something. We're capable of living in harmony with the pterodactyls. Why can't any of these other creatures get along? Yeah, I think the game legit waited to send uh, other dinosaurs at us until we had acquired our first cave here. Like, this pterodactyl doesn't count because they just run away from you. They don't actually even try to attack. But, like, things like this, it held off on. So I'm, I'm rocking the resources right now. I have the high ground advantage. Why would you even try? God, uh, Trump stuff just stopped being funny so long ago. <laughs> Seems like such low-hanging fruit. Uh, Trump is a caveman, okay. Mm, a nest. Birds will be more friendly if you can help them. Uh, so don't bash their babies? Or like break eggs or eat them or anything? Cause that was gonna be my original instinct. Maybe I put a boulder in there and pretend it's an egg? I'll try and help you find your, your little baby if I can. Oh god, I get pooped on so often. It's like the third time on this attempt. The Triceratops gets these little cycles of attacks. He was very easy to defeat. He kind of just would try and ram like three times in a row and then just sit there available to be killed. It was, it was repeatedly... It was a very simple sequence. It's just almost as easy as killing these things. Just start swinging like a half a centimeter before you come upon them, and you're just guaranteed to win. <laughs> these are like the least dangerous enemies ever known. More poop. I feel like I've gone a very long ways from camp. Still no sign of an egg. I don't know if I just am getting lucky or the fact that I'd never activated more than one camp means that like things just aren't getting harder. So I like all I'm seeing is like baby dinosaurs. It's not not much of a risk. Just chuck all your babies at me. I'll wipe out an entire generation of dinosaurs in one fell swoop. And then we'll be the the reigning kings of cave land. Were those caveman commercials like Capital One? Like credit card commercials? I can't even remember. I just remember they were gold. I also, I never saw it, but I remember reading that they ended up making, oh shit, <laughs> ended up making a TV show out of it, and Nick Kroll was in it. <laughs> yeah, that's right. There was a time when there was marketing that was so clever that people wanted to see more, that, that they would tune in to see more of it, essentially. I guess, I guess I follow the hand. It's like pointing me in this direction. Okay, where is the hand pointing me towards? I felt like I didn't... That guy went flying! I felt like I did not walk past anything remotely important and it went from pointing me left to right and I don't know when when I crossed whatever the supposed threshold was. Too many dinos at once. I don't care how small they are. That's... It's unfair. I mean, it should be like three on three, but none of my caveman buddies actually do anything useful ever. Oh, big guy. It's okay, though. Just send him flying down that slippery slope. Feels like Pikmin. I feel like Pikmin always gets slipping and sliding down slopes. Never found that egg. Probably never going to now. Oh, yep, yeah, there's just like uh, a bunch of them are just congregating. Just stacking up. Sending the little guy to distract me. Waste my club swing. Then sending the big ones. I see your strategy. Clever dinos. Oh good, and even more are coming. Oh, and from all sides. And now I, I have no hope whatsoever. There's not a chance I'm gonna be- yeah, that's... Uh, well, gr gr whatever your cave name is there. Didn't find an egg. Got attacked by like nine dinos at once. And then your corpse got shit on right at the end. So it was a perfect perfect end to things. You died the way you lived. You'll be remembered forever. I already forget him. <laughs> Wasn't a very memorable guy. <laughs> if you guys are interested in checking out Wooden Stones for yourself, links down below. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again soon.